Hello everyone, welcome to another video in the series of learning English proverb and in this particular video, we are going to learn about this proverb, a stitch in time saves nine, a stitch in time saves nine. Let us understand the meaning of this proverb and we will also learn to use this proverb in our sentence. Here we go. The meaning of this proverb, a stitch in time saves nine is, it's better to deal with problems immediately rather than wait by when they worsen and become much bigger. So whenever the problem arises, it is better to deal with it at that instant or it is better to deal with the problems immediately or as soon as it occurs. Because if we wait, then the problem will be bigger and it will be more worsened. Okay, so we need to try solving the problems immediately as we can. It is useful when it comes to finance, it, it is useful when it comes to our health, or it is even useful when it comes to our relationship. In hell, if we have a little bit problem in our body, then we are supposed it is very better to deal with that problem immediately. And we are supposed to go to hospital immediately in order to uh, save our time after, afterwards. So a stitch in time saves nine. I hope you have understood its meaning. Now let us use the sentence in, let us use this proverb in our sentence. Here we go. Because we anticipated and responded to the possible change in Facebook algorithm, so Facebook changed its algorithm and we had to respond and anticipate. Okay, the referral traffic to our website dropped much less than what happened to some of our competitors. A stitch in time saves nine. So there was the change in Facebook algorithm and many of the companies didn't uh, respond it accordingly. Therefore, they had a severe loss in their traffic. But on the other hand, we responded. We put the action on. In, we put the action immediately. That means we stitched on time. Okay. Whereas other competitors didn't stitch on that on immediately and on that time. Then what happened is they had a great loss on their traffic. But on the other hand, our website had not that loss so it was our uh, pro our problem was fixed or our problem got little bit consequences only but in comparison to others because we did we tried solving the problems at immediately and we stitched in time it means i hope this sentence brings you a clarity now let us move to another sentence in order to discuss it here we go example two Mary says, I'm very much worried regarding my heart pain. Sometimes it pains a lot and sometimes it is okay. And Jane says, go to the hospital for checkup. And Mary says, let it be. It's not that severe yet. And Jane replies, it will be even more difficult if it gets severe. Cure it now. A stitch in time saves nine. So Mary is having a problem with on her heart. And because of that problem, it is paining a lot. And sometimes it seems that it is okay. Sometimes she feels that it is not a problem. And Jane says, Jane refers uh, Mary to a hospital for checkup. But Mary says, let it be. It's not that severe yet. So she is uh, denying to solve the problems as soon as possible. She is saying that it is not severe yet. It is not that bigger problem yet. But Jane is saying that it will be more difficult when it gets severe. So it is time for staging. If we cure it now, then it might get solved. But if you don't cure it now, then it will have uh, bad consequences in the future. So if we stage it now, then it will be better for us so it means that a stitch in time saves nine i hope you have understood this particular proverb and in next video i will be talking about another proverb till then have a good time thank you so much